Hold it up, hold it up. Ladies and gentlemen, this first event will be a coal miner's glove match. One fall to a finish. One fall to a finish. And this is, is at the request of Tom Peterson, the best sponsor that a wrestling promoter ever did have. <laughs> Would you... Introducing in this corner, 248 pounds of booted Dean the Arab. His opponent in this corner, 250 pounds, the Top Gun. Referee, Sandy Barr. Hey, everybody listening out there in TV land, when we talk about the legendary wrestling of Saturday night, we're talking about Donald promotion. We're talking about the number one wrestling. We're talking about the number one wrestling going on in the Pacific Northwest because we bring it to you week in and week out, the best wrestling there is to offer, Jack. You got that right, TG. Top Gun telling it like it is, and we're getting ready for our coal miners glove match. Oh, Barry Owen joining us in the crow's nest right now. Barry, things are starting out hot and heavy. I can't believe we're starting out with a coal miners glove match. First thing tonight, the house of action. Well, that's, a, that's right. It's something else. Thanks to Tom Peterson, the great sponsor he is. He's got this put on here for all the people that couldn't get it down here to see it tonight. And we're glad to be able to do that. Well, we're just getting started. We're starting out with a coal miners glove match. Imagine what's going to be coming up next. Imagine what's going to be happening next week. Barry, I heard that that big hair match between Buddy Rose and Top Gun is going to be next Saturday night, December 10th, right here at the Portland Sports Arena. <laughs> and there's a lot more action next Saturday night. Boy, I tell you, Don, ooh, look at that big suplex right there. This is a wild match, but... I'll tell you, next week, hot and heavy, because we rescheduled that hair match. It will not be on TV. It's going to be a no-time-limit match, so there's no way we could put it on TV, but it's going to be Top Gun against Playboy Buddy Rose. And the $1,000 on the line already taken from both men, so to make sure they appear here on that card, winner take all. That, that, that means that somebody's hair is going to be cut next Saturday night. You're darn right it will be. I'll guarantee that. Right in the middle of the ring. There's nothing anyone can do about it. Uh, that was a good clothesline by Abu Dhabi. A little romping and stomping by the Arab. And now Top Gun's got a leg hold. And Abu Dhabi gets out of that one. What else is happening next Saturday night? Oh, boy, I tell you, we got the, we're going to have a return for the Northwest Heavyweight title. As a lot of people remember, Fujinami, the great Japanese star, won the belt from the grappler here, took it back to Japan. There was a match scheduled for there. It went a draw. They're going to have a rematch here. Next Saturday night, also the big hair match plus Northwest heavyweight title match. Oh, big backdrop there. Big, big match for the grappler and Fujinami. The Japanese star going to defend his Northwest title against the grappler over here in the States, right where the belt was changed hands before. If you just tuned in, we've got a coal miners glove match going here. This is our first match tonight at the Portland Sports Arena. Top gun going upstairs trying to get that, that glove. <laughs> And Abuda Dean just straddles him across that turnbuckle. And Abuda Dean trying to do some body damage now so he can get up there at the glove. And Barry Owen explaining to us what's going to be happening next Saturday night. As, you know, just great action out here in the ring right now. That was a big save by Abuda Dean because he just kept that man from getting that coal miner's glove off pole. And that man has never lost, the Top Gun has never lost a coal miner's glove match. So that was a big save on his part. Next Friday night, another or next Saturday night, another big match, a boot camp match. Golden Boy Mike Golden will be here going against Colonel De Beers in Colonel De Beers' match, a boot camp match. Yes, and uh, from what Colonel De Beers was saying a couple of weeks ago, that's a very ugly match. That is his match, and I'm not sure that Mike Golden really understands everything about a, a boot camp match. Yeah, it's good. That's going to be tough. Look at he almost. Oh. <laughs> Well, that puts a stop to that real quick. And uh, Buddha Dean in a whole lot of pain. And just trying to catch his breath. And Top Gun, trying to help him out a little bit there. Slam into the post. Yes, just like that. 
that you can't, I don't think you, no, you can't see it, but, but the glove is on the very top of that extended post there. And that, of course, is what both men are fighting for, because once you get that glove on, the match is over, because you get to use it on your opponent. And as Barry was saying, Top Gun has never lost a coal miner's glove match. Well, I tell you, I was close. He almost got up there and got that glove off. This was, they both out right now. First man gets up, he can get up that pole and get that glove. He gets to use it on the other one. You know, Barry, actually, you're talking about a triple main event for next Saturday night. Mike Golden and the Beers and a boot camp match. And you got uh, Fujinami and uh, the Grappler and really what's going to be a Pacific Northwest Heavyweight Championship match. And, of course, the big hair match. Look, Top Gun going for the glove. He's got the glove. He's got the glove. And look out, look out, look out. And he's clotheslined by Budadine. <laughs> Top Gun was just too slow coming down there and turning around. He got nailed by Budadine. And now Budadine has got the glove. And Budadine is, is putting... Yeah, that looks like that's going to be all she's going to write for Top Gun. No, he blocked that punch. He blocked it. He comes back to the right hand of his own. He's Now they're both just fighting for the glove. They're fighting for the glove. It's still on the hand of Abuda Dean. And there goes Top Gun into the ropes. Shoulder tackle, and there goes the glove again. You can see that glove buries length. They're over here. Yeah, both men, they're down. Oh, Top Gun sees it now. No, he doesn't. He doesn't know where it's at. There. Oh, no, he's got it. He's got it now. Top Gun putting on the glove. Look out! There it is. Here comes Buddy Rose. Hold it. Buddy Rose is interfered with the match he's attacked top gun he's trying to take the glove off of top gun top gun has won this match abuda dean just fell out of the ring now buddy rose has got the glove in his hand buddy rose working on top what's going on here barry i don't know this rose he's going nuts he's going to try to he must have really tried to hurt him so he can get out of that hair match oh rose misses with a shot he just takes a knee into the bread basket the glove is on the floor again and now we may have two glove matches Coal Miners Club matches and one. Look at this. And out goes Rose. <laughs> yeah, Rose, he didn't want to have any part as long as he didn't have that glove. That's guaranteed that. Yeah, he'll interfere with a match, but he's not going to stick around and get beat up. And the winner of the Coal Miners Glove match is Top Gun, and he's still undefeated. All right, get your pencil and paper out. Get ready to take down Pro Wrestling Calendar for the coming week, the week of December 4th through the 12th. Tomorrow, we're going to be in Finley at the Riverview High School starting at 7. Monday the 5th in Yakima, the J.M. Perry Tech starting at 8. Tuesday the 6th will be in Hoquiam, Washington at the YMCA gym, 8 o'clock bell time. Wednesday the 7th in Dallas at the Armory in Dallas. There's something very special going on to that match. We'll tell you about that in just a little bit. Thursday the 8th in Tillamook at the Armory starting at 8. Friday the 9th in Eugene at the Lane County Fairgrounds, a dog collar match starting at 8. Next Saturday, of course, right back here at the Portland Sports Arena. Sunday, the 11th of December in Redmond, Oregon at the Evergreen Center. Monday, the 12th in Longview, Washington at Mark Morris High School starting at 8 o'clock. And we will be right back here with more right after this. Fourth through the 12th. Tomorrow, Sunday, the 4th, will be in Finley, Washington at Riverview High School starting at 7 o'clock. Monday, the 5th of December, will be in Yakima at the J.M. Perry Tech Bell Time 8 o'clock Super Card schedule for Yakima. Tuesday, the 6th, in Hoquiam, Washington, the YMCA Gym. Another great card schedule starting at 8 o'clock. Wednesday, the 7th, we're going to be in Dallas, Oregon, at the Armory, starting at 8 o'clock. Now, in that special match there, you buy a ticket to the match, and you can buy a T-shirt for just a dollar. So you get a ticket, and you get a special T-shirt for just a dollar. Thursday, the 8th, in Tillamook at the Armory, starting at 8. Next Friday, the 9th of December, we're going to be in Eugene at the Lane County Fairgrounds, and there's going to be a big dog collar match, Top Gun against Playboy Buddy Rose. That's in Eugene next Friday. Next Saturday, the 10th, at the Portland Sports Arena, and you can get your tickets by calling... This number, 289-4222, and reserve your tickets for next Saturday night. Sunday, the 11th, in Redmond at the Evergreen Center, a dog collar match plus a battle royal. Next Monday, the 12th, in Longview at the Mark Morris High School, 8 o'clock bell time, and there's going to be a title match on that card. And don't forget, the new Russell Media magazine is out. Get your copy right away. We'll be right back with more after this timeout. <laughs> 